With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, so our question is, a fixed pull is driven by a 100 kg mass falling at a rate of 8 meter in 4 seconds. It lifts a load of 75 kg F. Calculate the power input of the pulley taking the force of gravity on 1 kg as 10 Newton. So, it is given that the force on 1 kg is 10 Newton. So, the force on 100 kg will be equals to 10 into 100 it comes out to be 1000 Newton now in first part we have to calculate the power input of the pulley so power input is equivalent to effort into distance divided by time so the effort applied here is 1000 Newton and the distance moved is 8 meter and the time taken by the body is 4 seconds. So by cancelling 4 with 8, we will get power input equal to 2000 Newton. Now in second part, we have to find out the efficiency of the pulley. So, as we know, efficiency is the ratio of mechanical advantage to the velocity ratio. So, first of all, we have to find out the mechanical advantage and then velocity ratio. So, as we know, mechanical advantage is the ratio of load to the effort. So, the load given in the question is 75 kg F and the effort applied here is 100 new, 1000 Newton. So, first of all we have to convert kg F into Newton. So, by multiplying it with gravity we will convert it into Newtons. So, by multiplying it with 10, it will convert it into Newton. So, by solving this, our mechanical advantage comes out to be 0 0.75. Now, as velocity ratio is the number of pulleys and the number of pulleys here is 1, so our velocity ratio is also equals to 1. So now we have to find out the efficiency of the system. So efficiency is the ratio of mechanical advantage in upon velocity ratio into 100 percent. So mechanical advantage is 0 0.75 our velocity ratio is 1 by multiplying it with 100 our efficiency comes out to be 75 percent. Now in third part we have to calculate the height of load raised in 4 seconds. So, as we know, the velocity ratio is equal to 1, therefore, distance moved by load is equal to distance moved by effort. So, our distance moved by effort is 8 meter in 4 seconds. So, our distance moved by load is also equal to 8 meter.
Hope this answered your question. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.